Hello and welcome back to my channel. I am Simply Brentley. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. For all of your manifestation needs as well as for personals, head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. Holy Father, angels, ancestors, speak through me. If I reach one person and one person alone, which I know I will, please and thank you. Okay. So what do we have here? Oh, let me go ahead and ground. This is for all of my Scorpios, all of my Scorpios. Change. Okay, so we have some change. Something is changing. Change is in the mist. Let's see what else we have here for all of my Scorpios. What is that, that fail, y'all? God box. Okay, so there's something that you need to let go. There's something that you may have been worrying about recently, but you have to let go of that. It's no longer serving you. You have to let go of it. You can't worry about this situation. Follow your heart, not your head. Okay. False mask. Take me as I am or nothing at all. Okay, and there's some more that fell on the floor. I'm going to try to get them. It's not for you. Manifest. Okay, so something you've been manifesting is on the way. It's a hell no to the no, no, no. Hidden relationship and immature fool. Okay, so somebody, you're wanting change. You're wanting to get away from a situation that could have been a hidden relationship. Somebody that was very immature towards you. It's like, take me as I am or nothing at all. It's like, you know who you are. It's like, you're a very powerful manifester. And a lot of things you were doing, you were leading through your heart. And you were just following your heart because you're a very intuitive person and you like to lead with, lead with unconditional love. But now it's like, hell no. You realize the situation is not for you. You realize who the fuck you are. You have no time to be, like, you've already paid your dues. You've already been working on yourself. And you just want the best. You just want the best, right? All right. Let's go ahead and put some of the Wisdom of Oracle deck on it. You just want to be happy. Higher power. Yeah, so you've been getting a lot of signs, a lot of synchronicities. You always are looking to your higher power. You're trying to gain wisdom a lot, right? You're trying to, you already know that you have the motherfucking key. Not for you. Okay, we have not for you twice. Not for you and it's not for you. So you realize that something is definitely not for you. You had to go ahead and get away from that because you were not showing yourself enough, enough love. You were not... Doing enough self-love, right? Fork in the road. So this situation could have definitely led you to have different directions and not know which way to go, right? You were, But you had to put yourself first. And at the end of the day, at the beginning of the day, any damn time of the day, whenever you're doing the work and another situation is not working for you, then you have to realize that you have to think about yourself and just continue to vibrate higher and put that energy into yourself, right? So that's what this group has definitely realized. Yes, manifesting. Something you've been manifesting is on the way. Whether that is self, that is, that is something that is like for you and for yourself. Whether that is you gaining your confidence back. Whether that is abundance. Whatever it is. Whatever you have successful business. Whatever it is. You have been manifesting something. You are very powerful. You've been through a lot. You let go of some shit that was no longer for you. You had to give it a hell no and work on yourself. And, and it's on the way. Yes, you're milk and honey. Because you had to figure out why. You had to find out why. Like, you had to find out why you were even doing this to yourself. Why you were accepting less than when you know you are nothing. You deserve nothing less than the best, right? You deserve that equal reciprocation. You don't deserve any of those false ended just trying to say what you want to say just the get you know get what the fuck you want out of it you deserve those genuine connections right just being genuine and loyal and honest and having that unconditional love and i feel like that's what you have been manifesting and that's what's coming towards you so you've been manifesting something that you deserve and that is what's coming towards you yes for all of my scorpios let's go ahead and put some tarot on it Let's put some tarot on it. 
Y'all know. Let's put some tarot on it. What is this? It's in reverse. Strength in reverse. Okay. So there's been some self-doubt around. There's been um some lack of discipline lack of discipline. So continue to not worry about anything. You can't doubt yourself. You have to continue to be very persistent. Sometimes that shit is hard. Sometimes, you know, it's easier said than done where we may have these ways in our mind that are not for us that we're thinking. Okay, Knight of Swords, and that's in reverse. You see this card falling in reverse? I have the deck up, right? But it's been a lot of a lot of situations where somebody may not be able to fully express themselves to you, right? And at this point in time, you're impatient with it because you have been very patient. So you feel like the time is up. Somebody may have a problem expressing their feelings as well as they just feel like they have some type of like learning disability going on where they can't understand like, they like, but what do you really want whenever you told them time and time again what you really want, but they just can't seem to understand or get that shit through their head, right? What is this? Queen of Swords, yeah, because it's like you've worked on yourself and you are continuing to work on yourself and you understand like what, what life is really about, right? And and you've been hurt enough. You don't feel like being hurt or put through no drama or no type of situations that are not truly for you. you you're, you're tired of that shit. You're independent. It's not like you really need anything. You just want whatever you may have. And you just want balance. Two of swords and hermit. And you definitely um, have not been in communication. You've been doing a lot of introspection towards yourself. You've been doing a lot of um, things in solitude because you realize that you have to Take care of yourself first. You can't be worrying about anybody else's needs, anybody else wants. If you're not can truly, can truly, if you're not truly, if you can't truly satisfy those needs within yourself, you have no business of trying to satisfy. The, it starts with you. It starts with you. Been doing a lot of meditation. If you haven't, you need to pick up on that. Two of wands, four of wands, ten of swords, nine of wands, and nine of pentacles. Okay. So at this point in your life, you're just you're just trying to progress. You're trying to progress. You want success. And any type of obstacles that have been thrown your way, you've been very resilient in overcoming those obstacles. And you want to celebrate at this point in time. You want nothing but celebration. You don't want to have to be worrying all the time. You don't want to have to be up in your head all the time. You don't want to have to be thinking about like shoulda, coulda, woulda. You just want to take those um, times that you have been done wrong and go ahead and realize your lessons and apply those and have your defense mechanism up now, but be consistent in your efforts that you want to do, right? So, so you know that all of those things that you've been through have been for a reason and you're applying that knowledge that you've learned from those situations that you have been through and learning all of those karma lessons and anything that no longer serves you, you're throwing that shit by the wayside and understanding that you need to have your discernment up and be con continue to be consistent in your efforts to have that completion and success and all of that that you want. All of that you want, that you need, that you desire, that you hope for, all of that. Okay. That's a whole bunch of cards that flip in the reverse. Okay, so that's death. So you're ending death, Scorpio. Okay, it came out in your own reason. In your own reason. So you're definitely ending things that no longer serve you. You're transform you're transforming. You're all of those old things that used to satisfy you no longer satisfy you anymore. Any of those bad memories, the six of cups, any of that dwelling too much on the past, um, being stuck in a rut, being stuck on in a situation that's no longer serving you, that's over. The fool in reverse. Because there was some type of irresponsible, gullible type of behavior where you were just believing potential, but not really. I mean, it was just potential and you're, you were believing potential, but now you're realizing you can't believe potential. It's only what you do and show me, right? Potential is just potential. That's all it is. Is what you could do, but that's not what you're applying yourself to do, right? You weren't seeing shit clearly. It was like you were in a fog. But you hopped the fuck out of that fog about any type of thing that, any type of baggage that you were carrying, anything that was difficult, any type of delayed plans, any type of the naysayers, any type of, um, any type of old grief that you were carrying and self-doubt, any type of one-sided, like you're not being able to see shit very clearly, any type of shit like that, you're having that shit over with. All of that shit is over with for you, and you're moving on to new. You're moving on to new. You want to reconcile with yourself. You want to reconcile with yourself, and you're changing direction, and the direction you're going is towards success, and the success that you want is happiness. 
You just want happiness and you want to continue to manifest and understand that you have the power and the key to unlock everything you want, you need, that you desire and you hope for. And you're working on yourself. And that's the most important place to start with is yourself. All right, all right, all right. Don't forget to get your energy in and like, comment, and subscribe. For all of your manifestation needs as well as for personals, head on over to my website, energyllc.com. The link will be in the description box below. As always, peace, love, and namaste.